If you want to know the best lesbian TV shows, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of the 2010s. Number 10. Rookie Blue, created by Tassie Cameron, Morwen Brebner, and Ellen Vanstone. Often described as the Grey's Anatomy of the World of Rookie Cops, the show follows a group of fresh from Academy police. Focusing on their everyday struggles, coping with duties and fear, we witness them overcoming social boundaries, bonding with one another, fighting romance in the workplace, and dealing with the expectations and anxieties of their loved ones. As faces come and go, we learn to love the wide cast of characters. And I have no hair. Not exactly a fairy tale. No. Hmm. Still kind of beautiful, though. Number nine. You practically forced me to. It's like you wanted me to fall in love with him, but why? Dickinson is a comedy television series created by Elena Smith. Exploring the life of one of America's most daring, greatest, and most influential, yet critically underrated poets of all time, Dickinson is set in the era of Emily Dickinson, who explores boundaries of society and gender with perspectives that expand well beyond her own time. Enchanted with a point of view too revolutionary for the people around her, it is one woman against the world. You really are my favorite person in the world. Emily. Number eight. Oh my god, I did not expect you to call. Mm. I can't stay away from you. Jane the Virgin is a comedy drama TV series created by Jenny Snyder Ehrman. Some miracles are just inexplicable, even though this one might be plausible, but just frustratingly coincidental. After a religious virgin is accidentally impregnated during a uterus examination, she is thrown into a life of chaos. Together with her long-term boyfriend, she must overcome the troubles of being a virgin mother while also managing her feelings for a too-hot-to-handle hotelier. This is just a temporary thing. Okay, well then let's, let's just enjoy it while it lasts. Number seven. <laughs> you really are a saint, aren't you? Pretty much. Hot saint. Really? Oh, yeah. The Fosters is a family drama television series created by Peter Page and Bradley Bredewig. Family is always a concoction of different perspectives and opinions, but this show takes it to a whole new level. Introducing The Fosters, the most colorful and absurd multi-ethnic family you'll ever meet. With foster children from around the globe, different parental relationships, and a lot of love, we follow them through their hilarious daily struggles and successes. Mm -hmm. Oh, we can't do this. Why not? Because the kids are right oh, inside. They're going to come looking for us, please. Number six. Orange is the New Black, created by Genji Cohen. Bringing to light life in female prisons with a witty and provocative humor, as well as shocking truths about an unjust system. Orange is the New Black follows upper-middle-class Piper, whose quiet suburban life is suddenly interrupted by a 15-month prison sentence. Now stumbling down the rabbit hole of a completely new life, she must adapt before it eats her up. Will I get in trouble? God, I hope so. <laughs> <sighs> you know what I mean. Number five. Gentleman Jack, created by Sally Wainwright. Brokenheartedly escaping a traumatizing past, a witty and endearing Miss Anne Lister leaves her old home to live in her family home deep in the lush landscape of Halifax, West Yorkshire. Determined to restore her uncle's estate, she comes face to face with two brothers who have been taking advantage of the Lister coal mine for their own good. Surprisingly, however, a romance sparks that will have its own consequences. I don't want to go. I know. I know. Night. Number 4 Black Sails, created by Jonathan E. Steinberg and Robert Levine. Taking you into a world populated by honorable thieves and adventurous men enthralled by ocean, we encounter the feared pirate Captain Flint, who has just recruited a new crew member, the cook, John Silver. But as the governments of the world declare pirates the enemies of humanity, the deadliest passion on the planet becomes even deadlier, and Flint wages a war against civilization. Round of applause, the new governor. Somewhere in London, some foul fuck will get news of all of this. Light his pipe and say, 
Finally, all is right again in Nassau. Number three. Fourth time this morning. He slept through the others. Oh my God, I'm sorry. My coworker's very excitable. Orphan Black is a Canadian science fiction thriller television series created by Graham Manson and John Fawcett. The series focuses on Sarah Manning, who has had a difficult life living in foster care. Sarah's life changes in an instant when she witnesses a woman who looks exactly like her commit suicide. Sensing an opportunity, she takes on the deceased woman's identity. But she soon discovers that the doppelganger is not just a one-off. And the more she investigates this strange occurrence, the more dangerous it gets. I made this for you. Put licorice root in it. I'll help with that cough you've got. But you, my dear, have to earn it. Number two. Good at that kind of stuff. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I'm sorry. Catch my breath. My breath. <laughs> Euphoria is a teen drama television series created by Sam Levinson and is loosely based on the Israeli miniseries of the same name. It follows a group of high school students through their experiences of drugs, sex, and violence, with praise going into its acting, story, visuals, and approach to mature subject matter. The series was met with a positive response from critics. It is at times hard to watch, but balances its brutal honesty with an empathetic and visually gorgeous eye to create a uniquely challenging series. Can we just pretend like what I did wasn't super weird? It wasn't weird. It was weird, but we don't have to talk about it. Talk about what? Nothing. Before we unveil TV show number one, here are some honorable mentions. This is why you need to be more careful. My lips are already chapped from all the behind I've had to kiss. Well... What if I gave you something better to kiss? I felt like I'd been holding for questioning. Did you worry what I might do to you? Do you want me to show you? Number one. I got you to protect me. No. Everyone I care about ends up dead. What did you say? Wentworth is a drama television series created by Radulovic, David Hannum, and Reg Watson. Set in modern-day Australia, this exploration of prison life follows a traumatized wife who is put in prison after attempting to murder her husband. While unaware of the truth that led to where she is, we follow B. Smith's search for redemption and her journey to figure out how to survive in prison life while climbing the hierarchy within the system. But with every friend that is one, a new enemy lurks behind the next corner. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.